Hi, I'm Danny with Ottawa & Sons Nursery. I wanted to invite you to my yard here for a little winter maintenance pruning. Uh, this plant here is a milkweed plant. It's a favorite food of the monarch butterfly. Uh, they love to volunteer in landscapes. This particular one is a non-native milkweed. Uh, and one of the problems with this plant is it doesn't go dormant in the winter here. Now that's great for the landscape because you can even see on this one, it's actually starting to push flowers. If you bring the camera a little closer, so um, we're starting to push some flowers. You can, it's very distinctive in the landscape. And when it breaks, you can see it gets its name from the milk that comes out, uh, the sap that looks like milk that comes out from the stem. So why are we talking about this plant this time of year? So one of the problems with this plant, because it, over, because it does not go dormant, is that it harbors a bacteria that can, is thought to be linked to killing monarch butterflies. So one of the things that we can do to help limit the spread of that bacteria and the proliferation of that bacteria in the environment is to cut this back and force it into dormancy. So um, pretty simple process. So we're just gonna cut it back so there's no leaves and that'll force this to regrow and there will be no bacteria carried over from last year. It'll get reinfested throughout the season, but there'll be much less much lower likelihood of the monarch butterfly getting infected. So very simple, come down low, cut it up. I recommend wearing gloves. If you get the sap on your hands, it can be mildly irritating. Wash it off after you're done um, if you do. And then I just come through here, pull these leaves off and it'll grow back great from this. Um, if you do have a native milkweed, uh, they're also available on the market. I'd recommend planting those. They go dormant in the winter, um, but they're a preferred host for the monarch butterfly, and they love them. So um, just remember, one of the goals of this plant is that you get beautiful caterpillars on it for monarch butterflies. And uh, so hopefully you see their beautiful black, yellow, and white stripes on your milkweed plant going into the spring. So uh, if you have any questions, please comment below. Thank you for watching.